All right, friends, I'm gonna go ahead and get started on what I am cooking for supper tonight. Um, I am going to be cooking something that Miss Penny told me about, and um, it's manwich on garlic bread toast. So I don't know if you like Sloppy Joes, but if you do, you have to get this brand, the actual manwich brand, okay? Because um, there really is a difference between this and the cheap stuff, okay? So, um, if you can get this, okay? So, this is probably the easiest thing that you're going to cook. But first, I want to show you what I'm, okay, so, like, I'm all about buying the cheap stuff. So, look, I got to Kroger Texas Toast. Like, it's fine, okay? Read your directions, 450. So, the first thing you want to do is you want to turn your oven on bake, okay? That needs to be first and foremost, okay? While I'm going to go ahead and cook. All right, I got my stainless steel skillet right here, okay? All you're gonna need is a pound of hamburger meat, okay? Now, depending on if you like um, leftovers or not, you may make this with two of them, two pounds of hamburger meat, um, but I'm just gonna make this with one pound hamburger meat. You wanna make sure that after you use after you um, open this up, because it's got, um, obviously it's beef and it's not cooked, you wanna make sure that you wash your hands. Okay, so I'm just gonna open this up, okay? I'm gonna turn my, uh, my stove top. I don't really know, a lot of people have electric stoves. Obviously that's what I have. So I'm gonna turn my number to about four. You have to remember, friends, whenever you're cooking meat, you don't want to cook it too hot too fast because then it'll be done on the outside and raw in the middle. So I'm going to take my hamburger meat that I thawed out. I got it out this morning, okay? I'm just going to set this aside, and I'm going to wash my hands because I've been dealing with raw hamburger meat, and that's a great way to get E. coli and end up in the hospital. Not that I would know. <laughs> Actually, mine was salmonella, so what else? Okay, so I've got my um, I've got my eye turned on, and I'm just going to take my here. Bring that camera on here. I'm just going to take and see how I'm just doing my hamburger meat like this. Okay, kind of breaking it up like that okay now I know friends that this is boring but I cannot afford an editing program so you get to watch the boring part of my cooking so just uh, fast forward it yeah just fast forward it okay not a big deal all right you're gonna take your manwich and you're gonna shake it up really really good because it does have in you know spices and stuff in it just kind of shake it up really well. And you're going to open your jar, obviously. I'm bad at using a can opener. Really? Yeah, I can never get it. Oh. P.S. friends, that's my daughter Lillian. She's videotaping because I forgot my tripod at school because I was too busy talking to Marco about how he can't sleep at night and he took some NyQuil and he says he feels better. So, anyways, good for Marco. Okay, there's my dog. Okay, want to pound it? Yep, 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 yep. Okay. Starting to cook. You can kind of hear it starting to sizzle. I'm going to give you a little piece of advice. Whenever you're cooking, get out a Walmart sack. Stay right there. Get out a Walmart sack because... Say hi. Oh, perfect. That's my dog. Get out. Get out a Walmart sack because you can keep like all your trash together, right? So there's the lid. That way, whenever you're finished, you can just throw the Walmart sack in there, okay? I mean, it's not that big of a deal, man. Okay. This is sizzling. Manwich is open. Okay. I'm gonna take my um, 
bacon sheet, okay? And it says lay on frozen, lay frozen. It doesn't say anything about spraying it, probably because it's doused in butter. Most delicious. I don't know about y'all, but I could eat my white and garlic bread. Good old cheap garlic bread, too. It's fine. It don't matter. Okay. So they're about, you know, yay big. Okay. Yeah. Just. They look weird. Yeah. Well, that's what they look like. Hmm. Okay. So I'm just going. So tonight, the people that are eating are Lillian, Jamie, and I. So there's three of us. So I'm just gonna do two pieces a piece. But then like, I've only got two pieces left. So why would I? So look, here's what I'm gonna do. Let's just cook it off. Because you know what? I might get hungry in the middle of the night and be like, mm, I need me some garlic bread. Okay, look, trash bag right here. Look, see then you don't have to make 57 trips to the garbage can. Okay, put that in there. Friends, if you can, if your meal allows it, clean up as you go, please, for the love of Pete. Lillian's behind me shaking her head. She doesn't like to cook. She likes to bake. Um, and there is a difference between cooking and baking. And um, Mom is a very messy person in the kitchen. I'm a very messy person in the kitchen, and I really try not to be, but you know what? Jesus loves me as I am. Okay, so I'm over here and just frying my meat, okay? Still wanting to chop, okay? Still wanting to chop that meat as it is, okay? Just kind of working that together, okay? We're going to sit here and we're going to let it cook. Here's what I want you to do. I want you to fast forward through this because it's basically going to be me standing here watching this cook, but I can't hit end and I don't have an editing program. So fast forward right now. I hope somebody stays here and watches. I hope somebody, uh, I have an idea of somebody that probably would. So maybe we should just tell all of our secrets so in the event someone stays, they get lucky and can hear. Not that you don't tell everything about my life already. <laughs> she knows she's gonna get the leftovers. She knows that she's gonna get that greasy goodness on her dog food. And then she's gonna get to lick the plate. So my question is, if I have iMovie, could you not save the iMovie to your camera roll? I tried. I don't have enough space. If you don't, I definitely don't. And it won't be in your Google because it's through an app, right?
Now that I'm finished with my hamburger meat, I would bring the camera over. Maybe she can get it. You see that like liquid and stuff? That's the grease slash fat. Do never, 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 do never. Never pour grease down the sink. I've done that before. Okay, don't tell me everything. Um, because what happens is grease solidifies and it becomes a solid and it can end up clogging up your, um, okay. So I'm just going to take and I'm going to pour it in a strainer like this, okay. And then I'm going to pour it back into the skillet, okay. And I'm going to take my one can of Manwich. And I'm just gonna pour it Dang, over that's there. That's a lot of stuff. That in one right. can. I like to use wooden spoons. She hits me with them. Whatever. And then, see how I'm just kind of taking it? Okay, so what I'm gonna do now, that's our oven. I'm gonna put this on low, and it's just gonna kind of set here and simmer. Okay? So I'm gonna take my bread and I'm gonna put it in the oven for about two minutes. Just, I mean, literally just for a second. So while this is sitting here simmering, my bread's in the oven, I'm gonna go and I'm gonna get the shredded cheese. shredded cheese. I have some in the freezer, but if we're being honest, since I don't have my editing program, I'm just going to use what I have. So I have some shredded cheese. Um, this is just, you know, the... Now, when it comes to buying shredded cheese, I don't mind using off-brand, okay? But when it comes to the real deal Holyfield, you either got to use Velveeta or Kraft, okay? Don't be coming at me with none of that off-brand malarkey, okay? So, I'm doing that. Also, um, this is literally for aesthetics or for um, looking nice, parsley, okay? And I'm going to show you what I do with the parsley here in just a second, okay? So, hang tight, okay? Just kind of giving this a good stir, Nothing, you know, nothing too out of the, all right, get my pot holders, okay, now, I've gotten my garlic bread out, I've gotten my garlic bread out, got the manwich, okay, and here's what I'm going to do, I'm going to take a little bit of this, Look, and I'm going to put it just right here, okay? Again, this came from Miss Penny. She said that her people loved it. If you'll notice, I'm just using kind of a spoonful, just kind of putting it on there. Normally, oops, um, our family has what they call sloppy fries. So, one time, I didn't have any bread, and... Um, you know, you eat sloppy joes on hamburger buns for the most part. I didn't have any. Well, we normally eat them with fries as well. So I said, uh, we're gonna take the sloppy joe mix and we're gonna put it on the fries and sprinkle it with cheese. And that's normally how we eat it. It's called sloppy fries. Mm -hmm. And it's, it is good. It's just a fast way, especially like, um, like if your parents are working late and you're at home and, you know, you might want to help, you know, help them out. Or honestly, if they're like, I don't feel like cooking. This is like really, really, I mean, manwich is like one of the easiest things you can cook. Now, 
Don't burn people out on it. I've been known to do that. Spaghetti, meatloaf, what else? I don't know. I just Spaghetti, whenever... meatloaf, and roast. Oh, that's your dad. Her dad loves roast. All right, so I've used all of my manwich, so that's a pretty good, right? Okay, so I'm gonna move that over to the side. Again, I don't, look at that deliciousness. Now, I don't have tons of shredded cheese. But look, I'm just gonna kind of pile it on there like that, okay? This is just the cheddar, Monterey Jack, whatever. Fiesta Bellini. Yeah, mainly what you use. Well, I might have more than I think. I think I'm gonna be able to make it, friends. I couldn't have done that again if I tried. Okay, now, here's what I'm going to... The parsley does not have a taste. It's literally there for decoration, for decoration and to look pretty. My mother-in-law, who is one of the best cooks ever, Lillian's Nana, her theory is you eat with your eyes first, meaning if it looks disgusting, chances are you're not going to eat it. She's all about the way something looks to make sure that it looks pretty. So I'm gonna pop this back in the oven. Being very careful. Okay. And I'm just really gonna wait until the cheese melts. So probably in about three minutes, I'm gonna go ahead and set my timer so I don't burn the bread. Funny story, my grandmother always burnt the bread. Always, always, always. So <clears throat> basically you're going to be looking at nothing um, while this cooks. Sorry, friends. It's how it is. I'm a broke teacher. Oh, don't forget. Your trash goes in the Walmart sack. Perfect. I bet Noah Nichols would know how to edit it. He knows how to do all that stuff. They're in Bubba's room. Who are they to? I don't know. All right, we have about another minute and a half. Um, let's see, turn myself over. I can't, I can't do it, why? Because you can't do it once you start the video. Oh, that's right, yeah. Okay, so here's some of the things that we're probably going to be cooking um, in the next week or so. We're gonna be cooking chocolate chip cookies. We're gonna be cooking um, a strawberry pie. Oatmeal raisin cookies, Oreo balls, luscious. We're gonna decorate those for Christmas, and an apple pie. Um, this is pretty much like the only, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Supper. Supper type meal. If though, you do want me to cook like maybe more like supper type things for you that would be easier like easy stuff like this, let me know. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. Hit like and subscribe. And um, let me know in the comment box what a, what's some of the other things that you influencers say. No. You would think I know. There's my dog. Okay, we got eight seconds. Timer. I smell the things. I see the goodness. Penny Wilson. 
You've outdone yourself. I wish TV had smell a vision Look at that, friends. That's supper. That's all you need. How delicious is that? See, and look right here with the parsley. I mean, let's be honest. Honestly, that really does look better, okay? All right, so that's it. That's supper, garlic sloppy joe toast, okay? Um, if you have any questions, if you decide to make this, let me know. Upload it. No, don't upload it. Well, put the pictures on the post so that I know. Again, this is super simple, and uh, thank you so much for watching.